Hello, welcome in to the Oaky Smoking Outdoor Kitchen. So today I'm gonna go ahead and try another smashed burger. I've done one on this channel before. It was a little bit okay. We're gonna try it again. Uh, and I'm gonna spice it up. So I haven't done a whole lot of hot spicy stuff. Uh, so today, this is just one patty and it is three ounces. It's, I'm gonna mix this together. It's three ounces of regular pork sausage and 80-20 ground beef. I've got a fourth a teaspoon of chili powder and a fourth a teaspoon of cayenne pepper. This is only one patty, one six inch, six inch burger, so that's more than enough, I think. I'm gonna saute up a jalapeno and onion. Add a little bit of a hot habanero cheese to it and put it on a bun. So here we go, let's do it. First, let me get some gloves on. Just put one on this hand. And I'm gonna mix this together. This is the hamburger and sausage going in together. Going to go ahead and add the two spices. Get all of it off in there. Meld that in as well. And you can add some salt and pepper here. But if you watch this channel at all, my homemade SPG, all purpose seasoning. I'm just gonna sprinkle that, just some of that on there, just a little bit, eh, a little more. Mix that all in. We're gonna go ahead and let that set as a little round about a six inch ball there let's go ahead and cut up a little bit of this jalapeno and some of this onion here Dice it just a little bit. Because I could go ahead and put these vegetables in there and mix it all in, and I bet that would be good. But I like to bring the flavors out of my vegetables, so we're going to saute it a bit and just throw it on after it's done. That looks good. You know, I always think of this stuff as I go along, and what would be great is if I just smash that burger right on top of those vegetables. I don't know. We're going to try. So we're going to take the, the burger, pretty good size one, throw it right there. Just a little bit of parchment paper I tore off right here. Look at that, pretty good size. <laughs> Check it out. Look at that, throw those right on top.
Got to say, that looks pretty good right there. This is going to be a burger that goes over the bun, no doubt, no doubt. Let me go ahead and place the buns on here. Let's go ahead and throw a slice of this habanero cheese. Let's start to melt. Hot habanero cheese. We got chili powder, we got cayenne pepper, habanero cheese. I would have had spicy mustard, but what's an oaky smoking channel if you're missing an ingredient? I couldn't find it, so we're gonna go with Miracle Whip. Uh, come on, mayonnaise or Miracle Whip? Give me a thumbs up if you're a Miracle Whip guy. What do you think? Gotta like that Miracle Whip. So we're gonna let this melt. Man, that's starting to look beautiful. I'm gonna add some of this Miracle Whip on here. A little on each side. Come on now, <laughs> tell me, what do you think about that right there? Uh, probably could have went with one and a half ounces of uh, pork sausage and one and a half ounces or so of hamburger meat and had that about the appropriate size or a bigger bun or I like it like that. More meat, less bread. Let me cut into this. Nothing fancy. Let's see if it's spicy. Well, half of it's gone. Mm. Yeah, that's really good. I'm just saying, I couldn't stop eating it. I just ate half that burger. As far as the heat, it's got that little bit of spice. Um, I might have... I put a fourth teaspoon of cayenne pepper and a fourth teaspoon of chili powder. Could have doubled it probably, brought that heat up just a little bit. But it's got a real nice flavor, a little bit of a, a nice spice to it. You can tell it's got that, that spice flavor that I just like. Um, now that I'm talking, you can feel a little bit of it in your mouth, a little bit of that heat, but nothing if you don't like spicy stuff. This would probably be okay. It's got that spice flavor and just that miniature spice kick. Man, it's great. you got to try it. I mean, throw you some of that spice in there. Throwing it right on those jalapenos and squishing it on those onions. Wow. That, that habanero cheese. Hmm. I mean, that's, it, that's, that's a, a heck of a way to make it. And as I always say, food outdoors cooked tastes better.